what's up guys it's Spooky here so i'm back with another minecraft video so today i'm going to be showcasing this auto clicker called qc plus so yeah i'm just going to show you guys the injection process then we're going to talk about it we're going to talk about the pricing and whether it's worth it or not and yeah what's the whole point of this auto clicker right and um i am selling five invites so stay tuned if you want to know more information so let's get into the injection process Alright, so the injection process is actually pretty straightforward. So basically, the auto clicker is a DLL and you need to hook it onto another process on your computer. I know that sounds like complicated, but essentially, you're injecting the auto clicker through a process and when you self destruct, it self destructs and cleans streams from that exact process. So you want to inject with a 64 bit process. You can find it out if it's 64 bit by just right clicking on a program. Like, if I want to do OBS, which I wouldn't do, it says 64-bit, but in my case, I'm going to use Notepad, so i got to have Notepad open, and um, just look for Notepad and uh, make sure that's 64-bit, and now, you right-click on it, you go to Miscellaneous, Inject DLL, so this is mine right here, QC+, plus Yeet, and you can uh, close Process Hacker now, and just wait, okay, there we go, so... As you, can, as you guys can see, 1.4 and Spooky and QC Plus. Okay, so let's talk about uh, the auto clicker now. So this is coded in C++ and the owner, like, this is going, like, under recode. So, but the owner is actually giving me five invites to sell. So this is a private auto clicker. So right now, there's only, like, two or three people in the world that has this right now. So um, I know a developer personally, he's a pretty cool guy, and he's a pretty competent developer, so, you know, his products are pretty good, and he also made a few uh, little things for me before, so, the invites are 55 bucks, if you want to purchase, message me on Discord, which will be in the description, so, well, from settings here, so, it's a command prompt menu, obviously, but it is going through a recode right now, so this is not the final product that's going to be going out, so, yeah, stay tuned for that. So, hide key. Uh, let's do this and self destruct. And right now, all you gotta do is click on your toggle key. And there we go. So, in bandline client, as you guys can see, it's clicking for me. Now, there is one disadvantage, which is that you can't change your click settings. I find this kind of good because it forces you to play at a certain CPS range. Like, when you get mad, you won't, like, go up to 20 CPS, you know, it's making you stay legit, so I really like it, because this is designed for, like, closet cheaters, or people that just auto-clicks, you know, like, if you can aim really well, but you're just lacking the, uh, skills to jitter-click, then this is, like, a really good product for you, but, yeah, we're gonna hop into a few fights, and we're gonna discuss whether this is, should we cop or not, of course, I am only selling five invites, so, the five people who... Uh, buy it well like you know they're, the, they're gonna be the five people that are gonna have it obviously but um i know there is one another person that's also like given like a few invites to sell but i'm not even sure if they've bought it or not and also i do have access to whitelist people so if you bought it i can just whitelist you myself to the auto clicker so you don't have to wait for the owner or some shit you know so yeah let's hop into some games all right, boys, so the match has started. So I haven't played Minecraft in like quite a long time. So pardon me if I'm like really bad at potting and stuff. Like I don't play this game anymore, guys. I, I really don't. Um, all right, so let's see how well I can perform with an auto clicker because I haven't auto clicked in a long, long time. Uh, yeah, so it's pretty much just an auto clicker. You're not gonna get like that much of an advantage, but yeah, it's really just targeted towards people that, uh, you know, that needs an auto clicker so if you're a person that lacks the ability to aim i do not recommend purchasing this auto clicker obviously now it's not like all good in sunshine there is some bad parts obviously the gui but honestly it's, you really need to like have a good gui like i find it kind of like, unnecessary for like an auto clicker like there's only one module um there is going to be future updates planned for like other modules like reach and stuff so yeah oh Mr. Really good at PP here. YT with the name. I should make an account named Spooky YT and be just as edgy as this kid right here. But yeah, an auto clicker. Not really much you can do. So if you can incorporate your own W tap skills and strafing skills, then yeah, you can do pretty well with an auto clicker. But for me, 
an auto clear is not really going to cut it. Now I'm going to discuss like the, the price point. So 55 bucks. Yeah, I came up with that price, but yeah, I am selling at that price point. Um, now whether it's worth it or not, it's up to you because if I were to, like personally, I wouldn't buy it be just because I'm a person that's like, I, I look at value, but this is not value because with most private cheats, like private clickers, private ghost clients, it's never going to be like a value deal because the people who are going to buy this are the ballers that are willing to drop this type of money for the private aspect and for the consistent updates because I wouldn't buy like private cheats and stuff from unknown or unreliable developers and stuff, you know, there's a lot of like cheats out there that like, you know, I've got people come up to me with uh, clients like Blue Light, whatever, Unicorn, like I've never heard of these, like, like I've heard of them, but like they're not like from reliable people, so yeah. So whether you should buy this or not, it's really up to you. And if you're like a client collector, which I know that this is like pretty like infamous among the community, there are like a couple of client collectors, then if you value this type of thing, it's definitely not a bad option, obviously. But yeah, once I sold all five slots, I'm not going to be selling anymore, and I doubt anybody else can get it. So, and this guy just turned up his reach against me because he couldn't like, you know, actually fight me with an auto clicker or whatever he's using. I am using Badline Client, and yes, it does bypass Badline Client. I don't know about Lunar Client right now, but I heard that they patched like 100% of the auto clickers, so. Yeah, I wouldn't use this on Lunar Client just yet, but I'm pretty sure the developer has the intention of bypassing Lunar Client, so that's always good. And there's gonna be like new innovation coming out with the clicker, so we'll be waiting for that. Oh, uh, turning up some more settings, right, sir? Oh, oh, got a bot. Hopefully this looks smooth though. My last video was really bad because like, I don't know why. It's like some OBS issue with my graphics card. Like, ever since I got this new computer, I still have like tons of issues. Which is, yeah, it's, I'm like, I'm too lazy to figure it out. And I gave my old computer to someone else, so like, yeah, I can't use it anymore. Also, I'm using- I'm testing out this new microphone right now. Let me know if it's, like, better than before, at least. Oh my goodness. Yeah, my aim is so bad. With the- even with the auto clicker. But this guy's actually- is he lagging or what? I don't know. Oh, I'm not lagging for sure. But yeah, the, you, can, you guys can see the CPS up there, it's like randomizing, like at the lower tier ends with 10 to 14. So it is like pretty needed for legit, obviously, and he killed me, obviously. Alright, so next fight here, let's let's try to get a combo on this guy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, oh, come on. I was gonna try to count right there, bro. So this is gonna be the last time I'm doing it because I don't want to make the video too long, obviously. So, what the hell is this guy doing? Yeah, this is why I don't like Minecraft. It's I don't like to play cats and mouse. This is why I prefer CS:GO. Although, like, I lose a lot of the games, you know. But that's kind of the price you have to pay if you're in a closet because you're not gonna win every single round. Oh my goodness! Come on, bro. Why you gotta do this? Just come on. Why? Like, seriously, bro. Why? Come on, just, just let me slaughter you and end the video. How's that? This shit boring. <laughs> Minecraft. That's actually really bad, he can't even hit me. I mean, I am out of clicking though. Yeah, I don't, I don't like how, like, uh, Velt has all these maps. Like, these, like, maps with, like, these mountains and stuff. I like flat maps, like the one on, um, Faithful. Like, they have some really good flat maps. Like, I don't like these maps. These maps are... 
they're just a pain in the ass to like fucking run up if you want to chase somebody, you know? Not my cup of tea. And also, while I'm doing this, I want to explain the settings that you should be using for auto clicker. Now, my recommended settings, if you're like you're going super legit, are 8 to 13 CPS. If you're gonna go like a bit hard, like me. Go to 10 to 14, but just never go above 15 because I've seen so many people doing that, and that's just, yeah, you don't know how many logs you're setting off with that, and it's it's not quite humane if you're going to record, like, who can actually consistently reach 15 CPS, right? So, this is the end of the video. As I said earlier, if you are interested in this product, message me on Discord, which my Discord, uh, how about this? I'm going to put my Discord, like, in the description. Yeah. Join Discord server and message me, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. And